I'm now going to embroider with the ribbon embroidery attachment a snake somewhat coiled down the back of this jacket and I to get started drew a line down the middle and then as I was placing it on light and tacky stabilizer I made sure that I felt for the uh, ridged area that's in the middle of the hoop so my line was there on that ridged area and then it's smooth all the way down and my line comes down to the ridged area down at the bottom so that my um, garment would be laid on there uh, relatively straight. Because it is a coiled snake, and I don't think it's, I have to be really crazy accurate with it, but I am trying to be as accurate as possible. So that's how I'm, I'm going to start. I'm in a 360 by 260 hoop, and I got the ribbon embroidery design from the MySonet library. So I have placed the ankle that comes with the ribbon embroidery attachment in place of the typical ankle on my machine. I have my a full bobbin and I have my machine threaded and my design loaded on my icon. So I have wound the ribbon around the ribbon bobbin that is inside of the ribbon embroidery attachment. Of course, I took it out to wind it. And then I have my red marks lined up, the one the one dot, the red line, and then the three dots. I have my needle up all the way, and then that those red dots form an indentation so the needle can traverse into the interior of the ribbon embroidery attachment without scraping. And now I'm going to hook it onto the uh, attachment that comes with it that replaces the normal ankle and then there is a USB that needs to be plugged into the USB port in the back. Now the embroidery attachment calibrated and I'm just going to start stitching. So here is the end result. I will now take a darning needle and thread those ends into the inside of the jacket so that we'll have a finished edge and just remove the stabilizer from the inside. Thank you.